hello youtubers uh, i recently purchased this select r meter for my one of my project so today i'm going to unbox it and uh, i will tell you how to use this okay let's open it you can see this is the uh, time totalizer from select so as you can see that there are some input pins on it there are five pins uh, five connectors one and two is for input three and four is for reset and five is for range you can provide 24 volt uh, 24 volt to 240 volt ac or dc both the powers to the input there are two reset button one is on the front of the lcd on the screen this one and another one is for the if you if you want to provide an extra button you can connect 3 and 4 with the button switch to provide ex external reset other than that there are two dip switches one for power and one for fr enable which means if you want to uh, front reset enabled then you have to on the second switch which is fr enable if you want to disable the front reset button this one you can disable this number 2 dip switch now let's turn it on and see what it show on screen oh no now you can see that there are few numbers on the screen then it is showing 0.00 so there are two option in range uh, one is for uh, time which is in hours minute and seconds and other one is for minutes only so now the mode is selected as in minute so you can change it by shorting the pin 4 and 5 if you short the pin 4 and 5 it will show you the range in hour minute and seconds So let's try it. I'm going to turn off the power, and I'm gonna short the four and five pin to change its range. I'm using a simple wire to short the four and five pin. Now I short the four and five pin. I will tighten the connectors. Now fourth and fifth pin is shorted. Let's see uh, what is the output on the screen. Now it is showing in seconds, minutes, and hours. Let's give it the input and check what is the values on the screen. I have connected the 2 to 220 volt AC to the input of this time totalizer. Now I will turn it on and I will plug the power. Now you can see the time is started in seconds. I have disabled the front reset button so now I will enable and show you how to reset it from the front panel I turned it on and you can see it is showing 25 seconds I will reset this you see it is reset to 0 and again it started 
in seconds this is the selec lt9a the full model is selec lt920a v that's all for today's video hope to see you in next video make sure to subscribe and like this video all the best